got me guitar body back from the painters um, and one thing that really has stood out since putting the first layer of undercoat is the the, the grain, the wood grain um, I don't know if you'll be able to see that in the video but there's a really obvious um, wood grain in the in the timber that's come through the paint and um, what he suggested I do was go back and fill that with a bit of body filler I'm not going to um, I don't want to put too much in there because um, you know because I want obviously want to keep um, the, the wood as natural but uh, I'm just going to try and fill up that as best I can and then sand it back so I've just got some um, body filler there and I asked him again about um, you know using the builders bog and he said mate it's the same as carb hog auto filler which will work perfectly with um, the nitrocellulose paint that we're using I'll just quickly mix this up down there so you can see what I'm doing got this mixed up. I'm just going to apply it with this small spatch first. I've done this so I just give it a good sand back probably take it almost back to timber because I really don't want to load it up with too much paint and bog I want to keep it as close to the timber as I can but obviously you've got to fill up fill up all these little bits and pieces or else it's just going to look look horrible when it's fully painted plastic spatch and I'll just go over it with this again. It's a bit of a messy job, isn't it? So I'm not really sure how this is going to turn out. I'm hoping it's going to turn out alright, but like I said, I've never done this before. And this is really, it's just a trial and error. Like I said, I didn't really pay a lot for this guitar, so really got a lot to lose at the end of the day. There you go, I'll probably keep going with that but I won't bore you with the um, details with that one but basically I'll just keep going with that, get all that excess off then I'll do the front and the sides, I might even do the sides on their own when that's all 
dry. Just, I'm, yeah, I might actually just do that first and then wait till that's dry then do the front. Once I've done all that and sanded it back, I will post another video.